What's up everybody, Nuno here with Sunday Bikes. Uh, we're here at Cavda West in Del Mar, California, and let me show you some of the bikes we got here. Well, first and foremost, we got Brett Silva and Gary Young on the backdrop here, looking real, looking real nice. Um, in front of them, we've got our pink primer, which is, which is a super nice bike for us. Some Sunday grips over here. We got some Odyssey Path Pro tires. We got a Sunday free stem. We got Odyssey braking. We got the lever all the way to the brake itself. Really solid entry-level bike for us. Over here we got the Model C, which is a 24-inch cruiser in chrome, uh, which always looks good. Uh, we've got, again here, we got Odyssey braking. We got Odyssey twisted pro pedals, uh, pivotal seats, Sunday rims, Sunday free stem, Brock Rayford grips. Brock Rayford is the man and is also now on Sunday, which is good. The High C, which is a 29 inch beast of a cruiser. Pretty similar spec. We got some Odyssey Twisted Pro pedals, some, some big Maxxis tires, which is what we can get. Brock Rayford grips, black with chrome decals, always looks good. Chrome bars, Odyssey braking, Sunday seat. Perfect for cruising, getting your wheelies on down the street looking cool all around and uh, we got a little 16 inch bike here for the little guys really nice geometry for uh, for the guys to for the kids to really start getting uh, getting going on a little BMX bike and uh, start shredding at a nice early age guy here is our top of the line so uh, Sunday Soundwave special pretty much all aftermarket parts 41 thermal, heat treated, frame and forks, lifetime warranty, Odyssey Thunderbolt cranks, clutch free coaster hub, uh, current V2 tires, literally all the best parts you can get. Yep, this is our top of the line. It's got Gary Young's signature grips here. This is the bike that Gary Young actually rides, that he's actually riding in that photo. So there you go. We got frames. We got our top of the line Soundwave which is the frame that that bike is built around of lifetime warranty it's got wave tubing all 41 thermal heat treated removable brake mounts uh, comes in this uh, sweet army green matte army green now we got our boy Jake Seeley street sweeper guy this is uh, Matt Matt orange I believe that's the full name we got Matt orange here we got integrated uh, chain tensioners up in here as with, uh, as with most of the frames. Removable mounts. Yeah, this is the bike that Jake Seeley rides and helps design and he's awesome. We've got the Sunday Night Shift frame. 41 Thermal as well. You can see here we got the uh, 41 Thermal anniversary uh, seal there. Just so you know, it's the real deal. Um, Night Shift, matte midnight blue, integrated, uh, integrated tensioners as well removable mounts really nice bike all you know all full specs and everything up on uh, sundaybikes.com this here is our discovery frame in this uh, matte frost green all right hold on cut hey Mike G this is frost green right frost green okay yeah that's Mike G by the way <laughs> in case you can't see him uh, yeah Matt frost green uh, re uh, removable mounts again, integrated tensioners, sweet Sunday details on the drop out there. Mid bottom bracket, all the good stuff. You can see the welds. It's really nice. Sorry, Jake Sealy Street Sweeper handlebars, and we got some uh, night shift forks here. 41 thermal heat treated, lifetime warranty. Good stuff. Brock Rayford will be getting signature product in the future for sure. Absolutely. In the, in the works. In the works. In the works. Cool. For more info, hit sundaybikes.com. Uh, we got tons of information, tons of videos, and everything you need to know about Sunday Bikes. What's up, everybody? Ben Silver here with Fit Bike Co. and SM Bikes. Uh, we are here at Cabda in San Diego. So we got the new 2020 Sleeper. It's Ethan Corriere's signature SoCal Local. It's got the uh, free coaster, four pegs everything you could ever need for a, a new street bike. So the sleeper retails for $489.95. This is the new 2020 Phantom, Tom Dugan's signature. 
It is super badass right out of the box. Got everything you need on it for cassette style riding. Sweet new FU tires, chromoly setup, tripod seat. <laughs> Just the way Tom likes it. Got the tripod, metal pedals, cassette, and pegless. And the Phantom retails for for $39.95, also available at your favorite local bike shop. So this is a prototype BTM XL frame. We made it a little bit taller for Mike Hoder since he is ridiculously tall. So this is gonna be coming out in about a month or so. It's a 9.5 standover and a five inch head tube. And then all the specs are the same as the original BTM. It's gonna come in this super sick OG s and yellow. Also gonna come in gloss clear. Uh, so look, check out those as soon as they drop. So now Hoder doesn't have to run like, you know, over an inch of spacers and okay. so much seat posts. Like it just brings everything up for him. Because um, everybody's like kind of running taller front ends anyway and a little bit more seat posts. So we think this will just look better for him and, and people be into it. The graphics for the new BTM XL are actually hand drawn by Mike Hoder. He's uh, pretty big in the graffiti scene. So he wanted to do these ones himself and hammered out this cool font and the cool shield logo. And over here we have a prototype fit street frame. Uh, so this is going to be used as our team frame. We're still fi finalizing the, uh, the last little details here, but it's got a newly designed head tube. It's uh, flush with the bearing on the bottom, so it looks super clean with the uh, integrated race on the fork. Uh, this particular model is fully brakeless, has a new, more dent resistant down tube on it. Uh, super clean, super strong, super stiff and uh, we're dropping some more details on these things pretty soon too. Hi, I'm Ben Ward with GT, and I'm here to take you through our BMX bikes. Uh, we just have a few of our cool bikes on offering to show people what we have going on. Uh, this is our Albert Mercado, kind of our mid-range of our team bikes. Um, with every bike every year, we always try to go super crazy with colorways. And when you're working with Albert, you really get to go next level. This bike is crazy. You see these graphics underneath here. And they look like they're a decal, but that's actually part of the paint. And then we have the standard decals that you would see regularly. But if you removed all the stickers, all of these cool designs on the base of the bike that match the saddle would totally be on the bike still. Super cool stuff. And even we have parts and accessories, a pad set. You can slap on this bike and make it super primo. But GT. GT Speed Series. This is our elite race level offering. It's an alloy frame with a chromoly fork. Um, we were the first to bring out production disc brakes on a race bike. And this is just a really cool kind of colorway that was influenced by the freestyle side of the brand. Bring that cool diagonal fade with the black and the silver. Makes it look really sweet and really fast. So recently we announced that we were partnering back up with Gary Turner and his son Craig. This was a reunion project we worked on. Uh, we sold a frame kit that was framed for candlebar seat post and with a pad set, t-shirt, and a lot of cool goodies um, through the Gary Turner website. And they actually just went ahead and built one up with all of our GT aftermarket parts and accessories to uh, display for the show. I believe these are all already sold out. They're a limited edition of 100 pieces um, and very stoked how they turned out. That's Dan Conway doing one of the gnarliest things ever in LA on his complete bike for complete story too. Super insane. If you come over here, we get into some of our big wheeled BMX stuff. Up top, we have the Dave Volker model, which was a tribute model that we did in conjunction with Dave Volker. Um, we honored him for being inducted to the National BMX Hall of Fame and did a colorway that he never had when he was a young ripper. Um, gave him this bike. These things are meant, you can rip a wheelie, you can rip around town on it, but it's insane to watch Dave go full send on this bike like he always has. Pretty impressive stuff. And then below that, we have our GT Pro Performer. This is called the WOW colorway. If you look at it closely on this side are the 1985 graphics and every single color this bike was offered in, in 1985. If I flip it around, you get the 1986 graphics in every colorway that this bike was offered in, in 1986. All the way down, the straight split down the middle, even with the graphics. Pad sets everything. Just honor the two first eras of the pro, well, pro performer and the GT performer in general. Super sick bike.
Well, that's the booth. Uh, for more info, visit gtbicycles.com. Thanks for stopping by. Hey, what's up, guys? This is Kellen from Premium BMX. I'm here today at the Cab the West show to go over some of the new uh, 2020 uh, premium products for you guys. All right, so first up, we have the new premium trestle cranks. The trestle cranks are a 24 millimeter three piece cranks, uh, full 40, 130 chromoly construction, 165, 170 length. It's a three piece crank and includes the bottom bracket and the removal tool with the crank set. So everything you need is included. These cranks are pretty sweet. They have a nice rounded profile on the outer edge here to help with the ankle bite issues you might get doing tail whips or any try to chicks when you're taking your feet off the bike. Uh, really robust crank. Uh, the riders have been testing it for the last year. Chad, Mike Gray, Blake Peters have all loved it. So uh, those guys fully support them. They uh, are gonna be available here at the end of the month. Next we have the uh, new premium four piece rasp handlebars. These are your standard straight gauge, full 4130 chromoly tubing, four piece handlebar. What makes these bars a little bit unique compared to most is they have uh, some cool uh, knurling on the grip section. This sort of just helps out with any sort of moto grip or any slippage you might get with, uh, with your grips. So that kind of uh, gives you a little extra security there. They come in a 9.5 and a 9.75 rise and they come in an ED black finish. Pretty nice little setup. They're gonna be available as well at the end of this month. So that's all we got today for the new stuff coming out for MY20. We'll have some more uh, items coming out mid-season as well that we're still uh, testing on right now. Uh, for anything else that we want to see in the product line, check out premiumbmx.com or visit one of your local retailers. Fuck you, just give me the goddamn thing. You're the G, dude. You fucking assholes. <laughs> <laughs> fucking... All right, guys, I'm going to go over the hollow stuff for you guys today at Cabda 2020. And uh, first, we're going to start with the uh, hollow BMX frame offerings. First up, we got Matthias Dendor's signature frame. Pretty awesome colorway here in the avocado green. This is sort of a uh, hybrid frame between flatland and street riding. Does the best of both worlds. As you can see, Matthias is ripping it up on this thing. Uh, it's got a nice uh, flattened dropout area here to uh, reduce any sort of drag or uh, limitations you might have when doing some rear, uh, rear peg tricks. Pretty nice little setup. It's got a hourglass shaped BBs, in case you want to drop into a Derek Duster or something like that. Uh, double gusted in the head tube, mid bottom bracket, internal head tube as well. Uh, all the specs you can see on hollowbikes.com. We got Chad Curley's infamous weapon of choice here, the new uh, CK frame in the uh, smoked camo colorway. Uh, this frame is a uh, street weapon, it's got a very short chain stay. Uh, Extremely wide tire clearance, 2.4, 2.5 tire fits no problem with the 13 inch rear end. Uh, again, mid bottom bracket, integrated head tube, dual gussets on the top and down tube. Uh, another absolute beautiful frame, and you can get all the specs and uh, information on uh, harlowbikes.com. Coming away from the streets, we got the uh, Harlow BMX carbon race frames. This is the uh, Citizen frame in the Nick Long colorway. Nick Long just parted the ways with Haro, so we did a little commemorative uh, frame colorway with them to represent his uh, going away. This is uh, picked out by Nick himself. It's got a nice Nick Long signature here. This is the most current BMX frame on the market for us right now, and uh, it's been doing very well from us. Full carbon construction through and through uh, with the through axle dropouts. We are working on a disc brake dropout for this frame as well too, so you'll be seeing a disc, disc brake conversion coming soon. Same frame, but in the, the Brook Crane colorway, in the uh, light pink. So all the same features as Nick's frame, but in a uh, awesome light pink colorway to go, uh, to go with Brook's uh, kit. Another cool product we have here to show off is the uh, Lineage uh, Grind Disc Sprocket. This is a pretty cool sprocket. It incorporates a uh, grind disc, alloy grind disc on the outside of the uh, sprocket. Pretty standard operation. Full 6061 T6 aluminum, CNC machined. Comes in a 28 and 25 tooth size, and it's available in black and silver. So another pretty cool pedal we just came out with is the new SD pedal. This is Dennis Anderson's signature pedal, uh, designed with Dennis himself. Got the cool SD logo here, Haro logo. Has a pretty cool pin profile in that the pins are more of a square shape. Kind of reduces the uh, the, the wanting the pins to kind of grind down or be ripped off when you're uh, grinding or any sort of stuff like that. Uh, full seal bearing, so it's got three seal bearings in it and uh, one uh, Igus bushing. So it's an awesome, super solid, solid pedal. Uh, and this is what Dennis has been riding for 
over the last year and a half. So he's been really happy with these. Another pretty cool product we have here, the Harlow 78 pegs. is a full plastic body, the alloy 6061 T6 aluminum sleeve inside. These uh, pegs come with a 14 millimeter uh, axle hole. They come with the 3 8 adapter for your front, front axle. Uh, these pegs also come with a included extra sleeve. So when you grind through the first sleeve, you can easily just pop it off, put on the new sleeve, ready to go. Sold in a one pair, so you have to buy you know one for each side of the bike. They also come in a pretty cool uh, pink colorway, as well as a uh, fluorescent green, kind of uh, if you want to mix and match or uh, kit your bike out in a different colorway. So pretty cool stuff here. Moving over to our complete bike range, we have the uh, Legends series. The Legends series is our uh, 24, 26, and 29 inch BMX bikes. Pretty cool offering here. First, we have the uh, Harlow Slow Ride. This is a collaboration between uh, Brian Blyther, Mike Dominguez, and Xavier Mendez. It's a, uh, this is our 26 inch bike here. It's a full aluminum frame, V brakes, 26 inch wheels. Awesome little wheelie bike getting around the streets and stuff like that. Up next, we kind of have the Halo bike in the uh, Legends series. This is the uh, Bob Harlow Freestyler. Uh, this bike is represented or goes after the uh, original Harlow Freestyler. So it's a full twin top tube, 6061 aluminum frame, uh, full three piece lineage cranks, Harlow Fusion pedals, disc brakes. It also has a custom Bob Harlow graphics on the saddle and the top tube stem and handlebar pad set. Bob designed those himself. Another really cool bike we did for uh, model year 20 is the uh, DMC Master uh, for Dennis McCoy. Another uh, 6061 alloy twin top tube frame. Similar to the uh, Bob Harlow, but with V-brakes on this model instead of the uh, disc brake in the rear. Again, it's got a fully sealed wheels, sealed bottom bracket, sealed headset, CNC machine stem, three-piece cranks, another awesome bikes for uh, ripping the streets up. Coming over to our freestyle line, we're gonna start at the, uh, our entry-level model here. This is our uh, Haro Lucadia. This is our uh, entry-level price point uh, freestyle bike. Comes in an 18.5 top tube as well as a 20.5 top tube. It's a full high tensile frame with an American bottom bracket. Comes with a uh, 8.25 rise bar and the Haro 78 stem, three piece cranks, and a uh, nine tooth uh, driver rear wheel. The Lucadia goes for uh, $329.99 at your local shop. It's kind of the uh, mid level bike here we're selling for Haro. It's the Midway. It's a three tube chromoly frame, top tube, down tube, and seat tube are all chromoly. It uses an integrated head tube as well as a mid bottom bracket. Both are sealed bearing. Uh, it features a Haro 78 top load stem with a uh, free coaster, sealed bearing free coaster rear hub. So a uh, pretty awesome build for the price. Uh, you can pick this one up at your local dealer for around uh, 480 bucks. All right, moving over to the race bikes for Haro. We have the, uh, the race light here. This is the uh, Pro XL model. This is a 6061 series alloy smooth well disc frame. This is a uh, new model for us this year using the disc brakes. This frame is pretty cool. It uses internal cable routing as well as a BB86 bottom bracket. So the bottom bracket and down tube junction is extremely wide, creating a very stiff frame. It's 100% chromoly bars with their CNC alloy stem on it, two piece alloy cranks. Sealed bottom bracket, obviously. And it's got fully sealed wheels with double wall rims. You can pick up the uh, Racelite Pro XL at your local dealer for around $6.99. That's gonna go ahead and take care of some of our bikes for the 2020 product range for Haro. If you want any more info, head over to our website, harobikes.com. You can see our full product offering, get all the specs, the details, and all the prices on the website. Hey, this is Chuck with Black Owl BMX, the home of Kink Bikes, Cinema Parts, and Mission Bike Components. And we're here at the Cab to Show. Uh, we're showcasing some of our brand new 2021 complete bikes that are gonna be coming out later this year in May. And uh, this is some of the stuff in our booth. So we came down from the East Coast, so we didn't bring a ton of stuff, but we did bring some of the more popular items. Um, we brought some of our Mission Bars, which is a cheaper, less expensive bar, but still a great product for you to have. Our Kink Samurai Grips, Cinema Grips, this is our Mission Seat and Post Combo. Um, our Martinez pedals, super popular. 
Uh, we brought PC pegs, metal pegs, and a choice of tires. Uh, we just kind of want to showcase shops how easy it is to do BMX and have not a huge selection, but something where they never have to turn a customer out of their store. So that's what we brought. It's just something that kind of hits everybody and a shop can do BMX in this simple way. So Blackout, we also distribute Fiend BMX and we brought a couple of their bikes that are currently out in the markets and in shops right now. So this is the Type R. It's got some great features on it. It comes with four pegs, a nice little bash guard sprocket, nice high-end bike, front load stem, which is becoming more and more popular again, which is cool. So we are pre-booking our 2021 complete bikes, which will be available to the public sometime in March. But feel free to go in and ask your shops about them right now. They're all coming. Let me give you a sneak peek. Oh, uh, yeah, I can't show you, but they're coming, man, I promise. For more info on any of our bikes and products, you can visit blackoutbmx.com, kinkbmx.com, cinemabmx.com, and missionbmx.com. Thanks. How's it going, everybody? This is uh, Vince. I'm with uh, Free Agent Bicycles. We're here at CABDA in uh, San Diego. Uh, we're here at the Free Agent booth going over some of the 2020 Free Agent bikes. Um, we have a few on hand here. Um, so just gonna point out a few of the bikes. Here we're looking at the 2020 Lumen. Um, this is one of our better sellers. It's kind of our mid-range bike. Uh, we do have two above it, but this one's one of our better seller ones that we, uh, we chose to have on display. It uh, comes with a 25.9 drivetrain, uh, Kenda tires. It's a full chromoly frame with a chromoly fork, uh, integrated headset, um, three-piece crank, mid-bottom bracket, uh, MSRP on it's 419 to 459. You want to uh, read up more on the bike, you can check out all the bikes at freeagentbmx.com. Uh, we offer a full line of race bikes as well as some 26 inch dirt jump bikes that are on the website. Uh, down below here we have the Novus RT. Um, this one basically we have two models of this bike. We have the straight Novus and the RT as I'm mentioning. This one here has the gyro on it. Uh, again, 25.9 drivetrain, Kenda tires, um, Tektro brakes. This one here is just a, a high tensile steel frame because it's one of our lower ended bikes, but it's a good bike for people to get into. Uh, MSRP on it's like 339. Um, you know, U brake has a gyro on it, so it kind of gives you the best of both worlds for the individuals that are not certain what they want to do. Do you want to go brakeless? Do you not? Um, you know, it's a good, it's one of our better sellers. We do this one again in uh, the RT or the straight Novus. Uh, check out that one as well on the website. You can read more about that one there. And then going over here, we have two others. Uh, first off, we have our Speedway. This is in the race family. Um, we're offering this bike uh, with two different ways, with a carbon fork, which is our house brand Q2 fork. Um, or with a uh, chromoly race fork on it. Um, this one's really nice. We have in the Speedway line, we do everything from our micro, mini, junior, expert, all the way up to the Speedway. Um, three piece crank, Euro BB, full uh, aluminum frame, uh, integrated headset, Kenda tires, um, sealed cartridge hubs. Uh, MSRP on this with the carbon fork is $729, without it $479, uh, great, great way to start to get into the sport of BMX with this bike. You're not really going to be out a lot of money, so if it's something that you're undecisive on, again, it's a great, uh, great bike to start, with, to start BMX with. Moving on down, this is our entry level kids bike, this is our free agent champ, um, basically just your all around get around bike, coaster brake, high tensile steel frame, uh, nothing too extravagant, but it's a great, great little uh, mini frame. So it has a low step over. Uh, we do this one in this version here, or we do it in the uh, Champ AL, which has an aluminum frame, freewheel hub, freewheel uh, rear hub on it. Has both of them have handbrakes, so they can look like the big brother. Um, great little bike to put around on. You're moving out of a 16 inch bike. You can go right into this. MSRP on this is $219. Uh, you can check out all the bikes at freeagentbmx.com. Uh, we list everything on our website with all MSRPs. And uh, that's about it. Hope you have a good show. All right, my name is Nick Benson. Uh, we're here at Colt's booth uh, at the Cabda West show. Um, 
have a 10 by 10 showcasing a few of like a, kind of like a highlight of a few of the things that we've either have in stock or just getting in stock for the season. Um, starting kind of with the bikes, I guess we can do those uh, 2020 bikes. It's a restock for uh, the remaining spring and, and summer season. Um, everything's landing today and tomorrow. So by the time you're watching this video, everything should be shipping to bike shops. The first one on, that we're showing right here is the is the Devotion Panza version, which is like kind of like an Anthony Panza colorway on the Devotion Complete Bike. So it's our high-end bike um, with his name and graphic on it. And also next to that uh, is the Gateway model. That's pretty much like the entry level to for our BMX line. And um, it's like a 399 retail bike in America, uh, four different colorways, 20 and a half top two, pretty much as dialed as you can get out of a box for the price point. This bike is actually an aftermarket build with the, the new shorty colorway, a couple of the new colors that we have with the Vans tires. We got uh, Began's new bar, the Heaven's Gate bar. Um, figured instead of showing individual pieces, we built it and uh, kind of showed it how you'd ride it. The big bike, this is the 26 inch. We also do a 29 as well, uh, two colors in each size. The 29s are new for this year, but 26s we kind of did a few times already, but this is basically like the best uh, bike you can get to, to ride anywhere outside of uh, the skate parks and stuff that you'd use your normal BMX bike for. Okay, so back in, uh, back in stock, and also a couple new colors are the camo version of the Vans Colt tire. Uh, we have a Vans collab tire and also grip with, uh, with Vans that sell really well. And we, did the solid colors but um, also ventured into a few solid other colors but also some camo options as well in the tires. Uh, grip wise we not only do BMX sizes and with and without the flange but we also now do a motorcycle grip too. Um, and then moving forward a couple more the things that we kind of take pride in outside of you know obviously making the rider have the best part or help the, be the rider have the best parts on their bike. We also do a lot of accessory stuff too because um, we all got to wear clothes, we all got to wear hats. So we do as many drops a year that we can with new soft goods, um, t-shirts, hats, all the way down to socks pretty much. Um, we're also doing some of the toolkits, other things to go along that are outside of the bike but things that help you on the bike as well. T-shirts in stock as well, socks. And then also Corey's frame, um, now coming in a red color as well on top of the black and blue we already had. That's pretty much what we have here, uh, our little highlight booth for, uh, for CABDA. You can find everything else listed on our website, www.colt.crew.com. Um, but yeah, if you guys have any questions, feel free to hit us up through there. Thank you. Hey, I'm Scott with Verde Bikes. Talk you through some of the line here. British BMX brand, first and foremost, of course. Of course, they're kind of our entry level bikes. New colors on the AV and the Eon down here, which we're pretty excited about. The Cadet, which we do several colors, including a left-hand drive. Still in the, kind of the price point category. Duo Stun One tires, 2.35. The other end of the spectrum our top of the line Lux, all steel bearings, all full chromoly aftermarket spec, kitted out with all duo parts. The Verde JV, 16 inch, it's uh, different than a lot of other 16 inches, with uh, an aluminum frame and a three piece aluminum crank like a race bike would have, which a little kid doesn't need like a three piece chromoly crank, it's also really heavy. Also for the smaller crew, the Vectra, which is a 20 inch wheels, but a short 19 inch top tube and a real low profile frame and a little bit shorter bars. Last couple of years, Verde, we've made a move to bigger bike category with 22 inch bikes like the Spectrum, which is all chromoly, all steel bearings, like ready to roll. Don't really need to change anything. Ride that anywhere, the pump track or, and in the same vein, the Modus 26 inch. All the Verdes, like every price point, the Verdes has all sealed bearings all around. So besides the pedals, obviously, but yeah, you can learn more. Well, our Instagram, of course, Verde, at Verde Bikes or VerdeBikes.com. Pretty straightforward.
Hey, what's up guys? Tommy Zula here. We're at the 2020 Cabda Trade Show and we're gonna give you the rundown on our DK bicycles. So right here, we got a 22 inch General Lee. This bike also comes in 20 inch as well. Really digging it, it's really popular. Over here, this is our high-end freestyle bike complete. This is the DK Helio. Really been loving this blue. Nice clean seat. And we just got some brand new tires on here as well. Come over here, this would be our 22 inch DK Vega. Really stoked on this green. Got this really nice brown seat. And brand new for this year, we got double wall rims. So that's really cool. Moving on over here. This is a DK Cygnus 24. This is a Harbor Blue. These 24 bikes, man, really been really popular this year. And then moving on over here, we got our DK Legend. It's got the loop tail, so everyone really likes that. Chrome fork and bar, silver graphics, and the silver rims to match. These will be the DK Sprinter models. These will be our middle level race bikes. So you're getting a pretty solid frame, 3D dropouts, killer price point. This bike really, really just gets the job done for that kid looking to step up to his little better race bike. Comes in all sizes from Micro to Pro XL. This is our 10 year anniversary DK Professional X frame. It's got a whole new look, basically a whole new frame from the ground up. And also new on this bike is we got some duo wheels, duo hubs, duo rims. And these wheels will be sold separately as well. So if you do like the parts, you can get those. You got a one and a half tapered head tube, box carbon fork, DK bar and stem. These are gonna be my DK Swift models. So these are my low wind race bikes, but man, these things are killer. I got them in black and orange. And yeah, anyone looking to start out, it's a really good neighborhood, racetrack bike, pump track bike, just a really good bike for a kid to get started out on. This is my baby. We've been working on this thing for a while. This is our high-end race bike. Brand new DK Zenith frame. All new frame, brand new tooling. Got some really cool new custom dropouts. This brake, it actually has a flat mount brake. So that's how we were able to fit the caliber inside there. Comes with the 140 disc and has the duo wheels on it. And also new are these duo hollow forged cranks. So really stoked on those. And we also got a brand new duo sprocket on here as well. This is our low end freestyle bike, the DK Aura. This bike comes in three colorways. Everyone's been really digging these uh, gray sidewall tires. And then moving on over here, we got the 18 inch these things really cool. Um, these stickers actually glow in the dark. So the little kids have been pretty stoked on that. And then moving on over here, this is our 14 inch Oxblood Aura. It's got a coaster brake on it and these really cool gray tires. The DK Nano, this comes in black, white, and purple. And then next to it, we got our brand new DK Devo. This is a 16 inch. This one comes in purple, black, and green right there. It's got a really cool like spaceship theme on there. All the kids have been really stoked on it. Uh, aluminum frame to keep the weight down for the little ones. And that is available in 12 and 16 inch. Go check, if you wanna take a closer look at some of the bikes that we have to offer, you can go to systemcycle.com. That has all of our brands on there. So go check that stuff out and reach out to me if you're looking for a new bike.